guys, we're going to be starting Adventures of an Iron Woman in episode 35 with an abyssal whip on the ground. I love it. I changed my UI so the icons are bigger. However, with that, it's a little bit blurrier. So tell me if you guys like this or if you like how my UI is in my older videos. And this one, it's stretched out um, so y'all can see the icons better. Let me know in the comments below. So we're going to get this episode started. Let's go, boys. Second whip on task, Mez. Oh. That's really good. That's <laughs> really good. That's what I'm saying. Good. Googa mooga. Alright, guys. We're going to be coming up on 95 herb lore right here. Boom. 95. Very nice. Uh, I just thought I would get that quick level in. I've been kind of passively doing uh, herb lore while at work. And I decided to go ahead and finish out the level tonight. Hey guys, I just got a really good drop. It is called the Drake's Claw. Now, what I can use it for, I'm not too sure. I'll have to Google it, but it's a 1.2 mil drop. So obviously it's pretty good, right, Kiara? Right. Okay, so apparently it's good for using them downstairs um, to make boots of brimstone. I don't need that because I have the Elite Diary done and I can use Picasian boots, but it's actually like a super rare drop and I think it's like a 1 in 2,500 chance of getting it. So that's pretty crazy, guys. I literally have like no Drake KC, uh, maybe like 20 of them, but pretty nice. Uh, I won't be using it for anything except probably, I mean, I'll make the boots of brimstone but I'm, I'm never gonna use them so anyway all right guys <clears throat> so i'm gonna be coming up on 95 farming after this kill sorry if you hear kiara in the background but yeah basically what i've been doing just to level farming is doing a lot of farming contracts um just trying to go for 99 because all my friends did it so i kind of wanted to do it <laughs> okay let's check that out should get oh check it out 95 farming dope and some isazor and watermelon seeds very very nice and hopefully i'll get 99 within the next couple months i'm not too sure how long this will take oh snap i forgot to replant another hispori seed but for any of y'all ironmen who are like wondering how to get some fast farming xp my recommendation is farming contracts I think I hit over 100 just today, and it's gotten me, I think, a whole level, if not more. Okay, guys, I saw a dragon impling over here. I swear I did. And then it disappeared. That is the most heartbreaking thing in the world, is when you find a dragon impling, and it's gone. Ugh. Found it, I found it, I found it, I found the impling. Yo, 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 come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh, two dragonstone amulets even though i don't really need those hey free stuff and now i can't get out of here greens too i would just like to get a couple more kills in what's your iron bank at uh it would be more if i didn't drop over my dex scrolls and my arcanes but right now fuck you anything but a chest plate i don't know what my bank value is it just grew 46 mil though all right guys i'm coming up on 99 attack strength and defense i can't believe it i should be getting them all around the same time i've trained on oh my gosh defense okay i got nine defense i thought i was gonna get them all at the same time but because I've, I've trained on shared but i guess because i've trained on special attacks and stuff oh strength oh attack Woo! that's so awesome i did it i'm officially max combat excluding prayer i don't know if prayer counts for a lot of people but i did it guys like I've never been max combat on RuneScape. I think I've been very close, but I've never had defense. So the fact that I have defense now is like official. 
Once I finish this inventory, I will get my capes, but we are now officially 2,191 total level. And I am well, like roughly 600k to 99 Slayer. So basically, I'm hoping to just continue doing Slayer until 99. Hopefully, I'll get some AVNC tasks and get my Arbordale skirt, things like that. And then I will continue on to things like bossing, raiding, and skilling. Lots of skilling because I feel like now that I'm getting close to that 99 Slayer, combat won't be much of an issue unless it's raid oriented or hydra oriented. Of course, um, I really want to get that Armadale skirt first, but oh my gosh, so much hype. I'm gonna go get the capes after this inventory. Hashtag blessed. Uh, this is a really big achievement for me. And for those of y'all who are curious on how I trained to get max stats, I trained everything with Slayer. So magic was um, trained through Slayer for through bursting task. I did also barrows with magic. Range was all through Slayer as well, and raids, of course. In fact, my range is 21 mil XP, and my magic is uh, going on 20 mil XP. So you can see that <clears throat> I have done a lot of post-99 in those. And then, yeah, basically everything was done through Slayer. I never did Nightmare Zone. A lot of people like to rush combat. I'm like, why? It's all, it's all going to come eventually anyway, but... Woo! So hyped. First time ever in RS. Alright guys, so I think most of the uh, pff, skill capes for combat are in the Warriors Guild, and then there's one, I think, in Lumbridge. Let me talk to this guy. I do want a 99 skill cape of attack. I don't know if I have the bank space, but I hope I do. No, no, no! I didn't mean to say, are you mad for 99k? No, no, no. I wish there was like a quick access to this. 99, I would gladly play, pay that for such a splendid cape. And then let's go by strength. Oh, the 99 attack cape looks so nice. Honestly, it is such a good looking cape. Strength is not that good looking to me, but I like the emote. All right, everyone here. Uh, skill cape of strength. Sure. Okay, and then we're gonna go to Lumbridge, and I think the defense cape is there. Okay, let's put my fire cape back on for now. Whoa, look at this. This is so sick. All at once, too. Crazy. I, like, trained on shared and control. Yes, sell me a sting. I think I have the money right here. Wow. All right, guys. Oh my goodness. So let's start from my least favorite to my most favorite, I guess, for the combats. Strength. Let's do... Ooh, I love that emote. That is so, this is so nice. So cool. Whoa. That's cool. And then we're going to do defense. Looks pretty cool, I ain't going to lie. It's pretty dope little emote there. I've never had like the defense skill cape, so that was pretty cool. And then attack, which is... Oh, I love attack! Bro, that cape is so sexy. Awesome. Guys, this is just unreal. The hype is unreal. Like, I can't wait for me to get my Slayer cape, my 99 Slayer, because that is like my ultimate favorite 99 uh, cape, so that's gonna be the big one for me. But, um, that's pretty big achievements today to get those combat capes, so I'm pretty hyped. Oh my gosh, I got an AVNC task. Oh, let's hope this goes well. It's a long one, so I'm happy. I'll probably get to a thousand KC on this, so let's really hope I get my orbital chain skirt on this task. Fingers crossed. Alright guys, I just hit 1000 armadillo KC. No skirt yet. <laughs> Rip. Okay, just got 96 farming. Very nice, trying to knock out 99, but of course it takes time. Just doing tree runs and farming contracts as usual. All right guys, I finished my armadillo task and no skirt. I'm at 1,029 kills. I don't think I can fit another kill in, but 
Oh well. Just kind of stinks. I still don't have these darn skirts, but um, yeah, I'm going to the beach this weekend and I'm super excited. Alright guys, we got 98 cooking. Check it out. Uh, this is just something I wanted to get and I was doing some editing and just cooking these monks on the side and we got one more level to 99 cooking. I think I have enough monks. Actually, I do have enough monks for 99 cooking. Pretty dope. Anyway guys, that's going to end it for Adventures of an Iron Woman episode 35. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe to my channel for my future videos. Bye guys.